previously on Church Folk Secrets. Omar, because I think I need your help. I might need your help so I can get churchified for this old yeah. man. Whoa, yes, you want that? Oh, father. He is yes. not that old. Oh, let's, let's retire to your quarters. Mm. Mm. Ain't God good? Come on upstairs. You've been on time. Mm. God. Oh, 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 yes. yes. That's yeah. where you are right now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 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 he's been on time. time. God. some of my favorites. Great, great. Mm. Thank great. you. You're welcome. Quite Thank great. you very much. Very kind of you. Excuse me, Mr. Harrison. Yes. Can I ask you a question, please? You sure can. Do you watch the Golden Girls? Oh, no. Cut it out! I don't watch the Golden Girls, but I do watch Sanford and Son. You big dummy. So, just when I think that I am done playing the role of Dr. Phil in this family. Something else is always popping off, y'all. And now, they're calling me because of some more drama that's going down. But you, my peoples, y'all already know why they call me. Mwah! Mother Pearl. Because I'm so wise. So they're coming to me for advice. Advice for Veronica and her crazy husband. Let me tell you what had happened. Let me think. I've known Ronnie and her husband, Robert, oh, for a while now. They got married just a couple of months after my Richie and his wife. I tell you, that Robert, he always wanted to be like my Richie. He wanted the cars and the clothes and the friends and the influence. And he thought he deserved it all. In fact, the two of them, if I remember correctly, they used to work at the same job. But my Richie, he decided to leave the job and answer the call for full-time ministry. And no one ever expects the ministry to grow as fast as it did. You ready to get spanked and balled today? <laughs> you ready to get dumped on. Yo, Rich, what's up with all these boxes? Yo, don't tell me they fired you. Oh, you got promoted? Hey, hey man. man. What's going on, you know? Have a seat. Have a seat. I'll tell you what's going on. First off, nobody's getting fired. And no, I did not get promoted. You know, I've been praying a lot, reviewing my life, asking God, to release me. You know, that 15 acre lot over by the lake has been all my heart. And, you know, we've been saving a lot of money, me and Rachel, and we're going to be breaking ground on our first ministry. Um, I'm working with the best architect in the whole state for the design. I have it right here. Take a look. So, this is one of the best designs you can even asked for for a first church wow so so you serious i mean i know you went to college for it but i didn't think you was actually going to do it i mean how, how are you going to support rachel and, and your kids like i don't see how this is going to work how are you going to make money it's not always about the money robert but don't you worry over the past five years i've saved up one hundred and fifty thousand dollars. that with the stocks and mutual funds that i hold also, Rachel's been in saving money, too. And I'm also a traveling minister, so that's generating income for us. So we'll be able to, you know, buy the land by, by, by securing a loan, but also building a house on the land and paying people to help us run the church. Um, so we're taken care of, so I'm, 
I'm, I'm leaving and I'm packing up. But the question is, why aren't you packing up your office? I mean, you know I got a job for you, Veronica, at this church, right? What do you say? Um, let me think about it. For right now, let's go play ball, man. Okay. You ready to get dunked on today? Oh, yeah, dreams. So, as I was saying, it did not take a lot to convince that Robert to leave his job when Richie left his. Because Robert just knew and thought that he would have everything that my Richie was acquiring. He thought he would have money and influence. And I told you guys all that he thought. He left his job to work for Richie. But little did he know he would be Richie's errand boy. <laughs> But it's funny. He was so upset. He was so angry because all he wanted was more and more and more. He felt as though he deserved more recognition and more money. Let me tell you how this fool decided to take what he thought he deserved. Yeah, I really like that. Yeah. Yes, she did. Yeah. Ah, man, what a Sunday it has been. Yes. Hallelujah. So good. Yes, yes. So, honey, are you ready to go? We got to go pack our bags. We got to get to this groundbreaking. It's our fifth yes. ministry. So Hard exciting. Hard to believe. Wow. Rob, thank you so much for watching the kids while we're away for a few days. They just love hanging out with their cousins. Oh, no problem, sis. Um, we love having them. Um, Ronnie's already cooking some food for us. and Ooh, you I know, wonder what she's making. I'll go get them from the Children's Church. They are in Children's Church, right? Yeah, they'll be ready to go whenever you are. Okay. Now, Robert, please re do not forget to make the deposit. Last time you forgot. Rich, okay. And members were up in the office ready to cut my neck worrying about checks clearing in time. Okay, and look, and also, here's some clothes. My robes and suits are in Rachel's office. Honey. Tell the cleaners light starts. It was very uncomfortable last time. And be at the house by noon, because we got to get to the airport on time. Okay, Rich. And don't forget to lock up. See you in a few days. Thanks again, bro, for watching the kids. So sick and tired of this. Shot my robes, clean my shoes, pick me up from the airport. I didn't graduate top of my class and give up a great paying job to be a glorified servant? You have an incoming call. Hey, boo. What's up? Hey, love. What you doing? Oh, uh, you know, just finishing up my spa treatment and weekly pampering session, courtesy of you, babe. Thank you so much. So, what's up? Did you tell her that you're leaving her yet? No, not yet, but I have a plan as soon as I get home. So, I'm assuming you ain't telling me you're taking the money either, huh? I've been keeping a separate set of books and moving money to this private account for the past couple years. So, while Rich has been making, I've been taking. And I will be sending you a few more accounts to manage shortly. Okay, that sounds like a plan. Hmm, I know. We're going to get everything we want. Yes. <laughs> We're going to get everything we want and more. All right. Well, I'll talk to you soon. All right, love you. Bye. All right, boo. Love you. I'll talk to you in a few days.
I'm making it over a bed of rice with some broccoli. Like, remember we went to, I can't remember the restaurant's name, but I found a good recipe. Oh, where are you going? Oh, yeah, that's right. Your trip with Richard. Is that today? I thought that was tomorrow. Wait, no, move out of my way. Move out of your way? What are you talking about? Come here. Come, come on, babe. I got something for you. Come on, what's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Yeah, what's wrong? I'm sick of you. I'm sick of this marriage. I'm so sick of this house. Can you for once in your life stop acting stupid? You know I haven't been happy for years. I hate working for Richard in that church. They don't respect me. They don't pay me what I'm worth. So I decided to take what's mine. Take what's yours? Wait, babe. Come here. Come on, babe. This is me. It's Ronnie. Come on. Talk to me. Come on, babe. Sit down. Come on. Talk to me. I love you. That's the thing. I don't love you. Wait, 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 what do you I'll mean? I'll send for the rest of my family. You, you don't love me? After everything I gave up for you, you don't love me? peoples okay so let me tell y'all something after that whole scene right there huh, 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 did you hear me Veronica is way better than me let me tell you something I would have bust him in his head told so we saw the white me coming out huh that ninja would have been lying on the floor I mean but you know that's just me I know I had a case or two <laughs> but that's not the point okay when Veronica gets home, it gets worse, y'all. Do you know she saw that man packing his little stuff in the bag and he started walking out the door? Do you know he left that woman with them kids? Poor Ronnie. That girl was devastated. Just devastated. Yeah. <laughs> girl, you know she Ethel. had the nerve to be all like... Ethel, y'all. Ethel. Why? Why you coming in here talking all loud? Can't you see I'm in the middle of doing something? What? Who are you talking to now? My peoples. You talking Listen. to them people again? You know who I'm talking to. Listen, y'all. Y'all know she know who I'm talking to. Yes, I'm talking to these people. They my peoples. Let me see who you talking to again. Mind your business. Here she come, y'all. Talking about everybody. No. Everybody business all over again. Mm -hmm. No, I'm you not. You always Am I talking about anybody, anybody business? business? Am I I'm not telling people business. No, what I listen, you don't even know. That's that's what I'm trying to tell them. What? Do you know? Wait a second. Was you there? Do you remember when uh, Robert walked out on Veronica and them kids? Girl, I remember like it was yesterday. Mm. Robert all acting all crazy. He got that other woman and got a nerve to be having plans. And motors behind us. <laughs> Child, after he got caught. Mm. See? Ain't What's nobody it? got time for that. What's that? A little bit of fool, a little bit of fool. Mm -hmm. mm. A little something, something. Thank you, good eat. friend. I said, man, that don't make no sense. And now, his baby mama done moved into town where everybody lives at. And guess what? What? He's trying to chase all after Ronnie. I know. He's going to leave it. her alone. But she ain't run, refusing too much neither, you know. But what I was told, mm. they now plotting, because the baby mama now is in town. Right, right. Yes, she is. Harmony, right? Mm -hmm. For mm -hmm. the sake of the kids getting along. Yeah. Girl, I don't even know how that's going to work. I don't know neither. Because they go, oh, we're going to get along for the kids. Tell you something. He's still trying to get him when he can fit in. That's a true kids. story. That's true. But besides him, so you want to say it's all him. But for me, mm -hmm. my gut is on that Ronnie. You know I never trust that girl. You know what? She I always whining, always got problems. 
I don't trust her. I'm and I think, always against you, pro. But you know what? I got to agree with you on you that. You have one. to. You know what? I got to see it for myself. Because the truth going to come out anyway. You know? Her mm-hmm. truth is going to come out. I'm from work one night. Of dozens of Whoa! Them. Man. And two days later. Mm-hmm. That's a clue. I told yep. you I'm going to have this thing figured out in a minute. Yep. Candy. That's crazy. Look at him. He looks mad. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Ooh. They're here to help John. Oh, it's always calling at the best part. Hmm. Hello, this is Rachel. Sure? Hey, babe, don't hang up. The kids with the kids are Ronnie. I'll be right back. All right. I built it. Jeff's anterior cingular cortex. The Reggie, I told you never to call me in the evening when I'm at home with my husband and kids. Rachel, I really need to talk to you now. You know last week was amazing. I can't get enough of you. You know that thing that you do. Look, come on a minute. You know you enjoyed every minute we were together. Don't you want to make it more permanent? Permanent? This was only supposed to happen one time. And it's been two years now. Now, if you didn't want to be with me, you would have stopped it a long time ago. But you make sure every time you get a chance to meet me after conferences or convocations to do that thing you like doing, you know. So why I keep sneaking around now? Because you were the chief bishop. And I am married. This thing between us has to stop. Okay, first, this isn't a thing. This is a relationship that you refuse to come to terms with. Once you finally accept that you've been more happy with me these past two years than you've been with that ten years of marriage to that joker, you'll leave him so we can be together. I am not willing to ruin both of our reputations for a fling. It's exhilarating and exciting, but this can't keep going on. Well, listen, I'll be in town for a church meeting with Richard so we can talk about all this then. What? You can't come here. Richard didn't tell me you were coming. Sweetheart, it's going Hey, I gotta come there to handle some church business. I know how to conduct myself, and I promise not to cause any trouble for you. But you know I'm gonna need something from you in exchange for my silence. (laughs) And what is that? Honey, can you tell Ronnie that your car is back so we can watch this movie before bed? Okay, baby, I'll be right there. Ronnie, let me call you back in a little while, okay? You know I still want to taste your sweet... Bye. Yeah, I 
right here. I hear you gotta go. All right. Call me back. All right. All right, bye-bye. Just speak her up. Girl. What is going on? Oh my God, her ears must have been ringing. What is going on over there, sis? Listen here. That girl just told me that she and Charlie was just sitting at the house. Uh huh. Watching TV. This is what I can gather through all her crying. She said that Harmony came with yeah. her kids. Without Robert? Yeah. Oh my Lord. She said That's she didn't know where Robert was. Robert. She didn't know Harmony crazy. You know Harmony crazy. She cool, cool. She brought that woman kids back to her, and Robert was not with her. Oh my God, did Robert flip out? She is over there tripping right now. Oh my God, she probably trying to break the door now. Get to her, girl. Oh let me tell my you God. something. Let me tell I'm you something. You, I'm gonna keep praying, but I ain't fasting. Mm, let me tell you, mm. there's a lot going on over there. In fact, this is what's really happening. How was your day at work, babe? Okay. Yeah. So what you do? Tell me about your day. Oh, you know, I fired a couple people. Just need to get better staff, better associates. Yeah, so the same thing's going on in my job. But I got something for you. What you got for me? Oh, you want to see? Yeah. Well, the kids won't be home for another hour, two. Okay, sounds like a plan to me. Company? No, uh, the kids are already back for about another hour or so. I don't know who this is. What are you doing here? I thought Robert was bringing back the kids. Listen, this is all becoming way too much. Can, can, can I come in? Come on, y'all. Come on. 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 This is becoming way too much. We need to figure this out. Oh, ho, 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 Harmony, 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 please, please. First and foremost, have a seat. And don't be raising your voice at my woman like this is uh, the house. And what the heck are you even talking about? Oh, so she didn't tell you how we almost got into it at the club the other night. Look, what, what, it's all on the internet. Babe, mm -hmm. is she serious? Oh, oh he didn't tell me. I thought she you told me everything that happened at the party. Mm -hmm. You left this part out? Listen. I mean, what the heck happened? Her <laughs> and her goons mm -hmm. decided to come over the other night to like Bert's that. bachelorette party. I mean, we weren't even expecting them. She came and sat at the table right next to us. I mean, go figure. Screaming, yelling, all sorts of obscenities, cussing. So Vicky got up to go over just to talk to him and ask him to relax and chill. Not I just followed Vicky over to make sure she didn't bust you in your mouth. Oh, she wasn't going to bust me in my mouth. <laughs> Trust. Listen, Trust. I had no intentions of going there to fight. I just went over there. Vicky decided to talk to her to find out just to tell her to calm down and chill. We didn't want to ruin first party. She disrespected me. Listen. I jumped in her face because she poured a drink on me. And Did she tell you that? And you deserved it mm. for okay. disrespecting my marriage and my ability to keep a man. Ho, ho, ho. Your marriage? Is that what this is all about? Okay, I no, get it. Baby, no, 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 no. That's not, no, you that's said not it right. Your marriage. No, I was I get talking it. about my past with Robert. That's what I was talking about. Babe, me and you are solid, and Robert knows that. All I want him to do is to be the best father that he can be to all these kids he decided to make and keep the drama off of our doorstep. Well, that is for sure. I was dragged into this mess. I didn't ask to be here. And the only good thing that came out of this, besides a boatload of money, is my son. And I love my son. And all I want is for him and his sister and his brother to have a good relationship and for us to at least get along. And all I want is for you to stop disrespecting me. Can you do that? Sure. I can do it. For the sake of the kids? Yep. Yep. Whatever. Sounds like a plan to me. I mean, I think we can work this all out. Well, Robert is just going to have to be able to accept you because you're a major part of my life. And you ain't going nowhere, right? You ain't going nowhere, right? I hear you, babe. <laughs> I hear you, babe. my results great okay so tell me what's going on yeah I still been getting sick 
What? Wait, what? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Test them again. You tested it twice already? Okay. All right. Uh, I'll be in tomorrow. Okay, two o'clock. Thank you, Dr. Mills. All right. TJ, Gregory, come here, honey. You're gonna um, go with Miss Harmony for a minute, okay? And I'll be by later to pick you guys up, okay? Harmony, do you mind taking them just for a few hours, sure. please? Sure, it's okay. All right, thank you. I'll be by later to pick them up. Come on, guys, let's go. Thank you. Bye, Bye Mommy. Bye, Bye Mommy. Hey, what did the doctor say? I mean, what's going on? You got that pizza looking like it's good. Girl, it's good. You know what I mean? Mm. So that's what had happened. Really? Yeah, that's what's all going on over there at that house right now. Girl. Hmm? What's really going on? What really happened? You know what's going on with Rhonda. What's wrong with her? What? Call her. Call her now. And let's find out. I ain't calling that girl. Call I just girl. told you what happened. Didn't you just see what happened? Sex, love.